So what flame do we want when burning off the soot or coke marker or soap? What we want is a neutral flame. The two cones touch each other just at the tip there. Now we just go to the panel and we burn off the coke marker and that's how we anneal it. So you can see I'm jumping around and not just working one area. The reason I'm doing that is I don't want to burn away the edges or overheat the material. Just want to get rid of the cokey and then happy days. We've reached temperature. The soot method, just a slight amount. We don't want to add too much and get the panel too hot. Then when we burn it off, we end up melting the aluminum. Now we go to a neutral flame. So what we want to do is just be careful and jump around the whole time. We don't want to overheat the panel and make it brittle. Be very careful on the edges because they burn away and get brittle very quickly. On to the soap. How does the soap technique work? All you do, we've applied the soap already and we just burn it till it goes black. So you can see I'm bouncing around because I don't want to burn the edges off of the aluminum. So we have our three panels now. The one with the nails of the cokey marker, the one with the soap and the one with the soot. So we'll start with the cokey marker one. You can see this guy bends easy. Then we can go on to the soap one, overheat it a little bit, bends, no problem. Then we go to the soot one, a little bit warm still, bend it. No problem. So that's how to anneal aluminium and that's the difference it makes.